Hello and welcome back to looking a bit more into the Novation SL Mark III series. Something you might not be aware is that if you use my driven by Moss script to control Bitwig, you can still use and combine it with the hardware features. And I like to look a little bit into that today. So one thing you should make sure is if you go into the global settings that you have activate the MIDI clock receive and also send MIDI clock here to the SL Mark III in Bitwig so they run in sync. And then you can also use the hardware features here, the zone, sequence and the arpeggiator. Let's look into that. Start here with a sequencer. If I go into the sequencer, if I start running Bitwig, you see also the sequencer has started here for the internal hardware sequencer has also started and we can also now record here into, I here enabled it here, enable recording of the sequencer. I can also play here something in there and uh, as you might hear, make it louder a bit. Also the metronome is turned on already and let's play something here. Okay, let's stop recording here. And as you hear, it runs in sync with Bitwig. You can also try that if you go here back to the Bitwig settings options and change here the Bitwig tempo. You see the internal hardware sequencer will run in sync with Bitwig. Another thing is you can also use the arpeggiator. So going into arpeggiation. Also that one is running in sync and let's record a clip here in Bitwig. And as you see, this is also working nicely. And another thing is you can also use the zone. So you can have up to eight zones. There is a default setup here in the device with four zones. And if you turn them on, go to the sequencer, you see those four zones equally distributed over the keyboard and they play in media channel one, two, three, and four. And let's check that, record here another clip. I guess this will be the next hit signal. But if you go there and have a look here inside of that, you will see there are now those eight notes I played and you see also they are on different channels. You see it even better here that these are the different MIDI channels. So you can, for example, play different sounds, different devices via different MIDI channel with such a setup. Okay, I hope you learned something and get some new ideas how you could use the SL Mark III together with Bitwig and make some funky music. Music.